back to our uh, uh, central, the one we tested all the, uh, the like we pressed all the ingots uh, to figure out which the switch is the best ingot for. So when I did, where, where, like what I selected here for this case is MO, I did two sets, one MO and one LT. And uh, you see here in the video, I, I like for single centrals to show video actually, it, it's more uh, uh, like uh, it will like show all the like the, the color dimension more than like a, a photo. And you see on the MO0 and the, on the LT side, the matching is perfect. The masking is uh, is perfect. The matching, I wouldn't say it's perfect, but it's it's more than like a 95, 95%, which is uh, pretty much acceptable. I would I would say LT is, is a bit better uh, because again, I need to remind you that not all the time we need to fully mask a stump. Sometimes we just need to filter the discoloration in the stump and that would be enough. And um, uh, because that would be easier to match with the natural uh, central. So what I did for this single central, I pressed all the ingots uh, to show you two things, the masking capability of every ingot and the matching to the natural tooth. And my message from uh, this slide is always to question ourselves, how much is every ingot's masking and how much is the matching to the natural tooth? So starting with the, zero, with the HO0, so, and remember that all the copings here were pressed on the thickness of 0.6. So all of them are identical uh, designed and milled, waxed and pressed. So we pressed the first uh, uh, ingot or the first coping uh, out of uh, HO0, the high opacity. So the masking is superb. The masking is 100%. Look at the matching to the central. I have a central of A to A3 here. How far is the matching? So if you imagine that I probably have another one milli to lay it to stack porcelain here, do you think it'll be easy to match with the central? No, it's not easy at all. So HO is not the ideal selection for uh, this case here. Let's switch to MO. And I have two options of MO really here. You might be thinking that MO is medium opacity. Why would I have like MO0 and MO1? I always had the MO0 and 1 as two different degrees of uh, it, it translucency and opacity masking. And the reason why is the extra uh, brightness exists in the MO0. The extra brightness gives me an extra masking uh, in the uh, ingot itself. That's why I have it as an as an another level of translucency opacity. So uh, when you see here the MO0, it's still masking well less a little bit less than the, the high opacity ingot. But do I really need more than that masking? No, it's almost masking 90%. I can see this a little bit the shadow of the stump, but it's still far away from the uh, A2 central. So I gotta, it's like stain it and uh, then uh, fix that stain by baking this uh, coping after I stain it, then uh, I would start like layering on top this final sheet. So it might be a, a little bit, uh, um, like difficult to do that, but with MO1, the same level of opacity, uh, you see now I have almost the same masking capability here, but closer shade to the central I'm trying to match to. So MO1 is uh, one of the, the perfect selection for this case, uh, but also LT, uh, and uh, pre please uh, like see here how I'm, I'm like the stump is is starting to show more here. But again, the question is, do I really need to mask the stump 100% or it's, it's, it's enough just to filter the, the discoloration in it? That's the question you need to ask yourself every time. 
So this is matching in shade to the central and at the same time giving me like probably 85% of masking to the uh, stump. So another good selection is the LT here. The MT also very similar to uh, LT. Well, as we said, LT is dunt and MT is enamel. Uh, but at, at a certain thickness, they're, they're, uh, they have a similar optical properties like 5.5.6, and we'll show that in the following slides. But I would uh, stick to the Dunton LT here if I really want to match and layer this uh, uh, central. HD is completely out of the equation. I, I can see the stump here at the corner, and I can see like a big uh, chunk of uh, gray here on that side, and that's not good. Uh, and uh, that's why uh, HD is, is uh, not, not an option here. And Opal, uh, well, obviously it's not an option here because Opal is the Opal scent, uh, again, exists in the natural animal. And I would use the Opal ingot. It's, it's, a, it's like 90% it's, it's translucent ingot, and I would use it just if I have like a no prep case, no prep veneer, and I, if I want to do like a, uh, kind of like a staining technique, natural bleach to uh, bring a, a, a shade from uh, up from A1 to maybe bleach 4 or uh, bleach 3. So it's 100% is not for uh, coping or sing single central uh, cases. 